finishing in a big group. He's attacking. Whatever you do, don't let him build a lead. Okay, I'm coming to protect you. The riders up front have a one-minute lead on the favorites group. He's attacking. Whatever you do, don't let him build a lead. The breakaway is being reeled in. It will be difficult to withstand the return of the yellow jersey. Okay, I'm coming to protect you. So I stick to the wheels in front. The yellow jersey group is one minute from the head of the race. He's got his teammates riding because in front, there's a rider who's dangerous to him in the overall standings. The front of the race is two kilometers from the summit. The gap between the favorites group and the front is 30 seconds. He's attacking. I don't know if it's a bluff, but the breakaway looks to be increasing the pace at the front of the race. The lead rider has 30 seconds on the favorites. 30 seconds between the breakaway and the yellow jersey. Watch out. You'll soon have no more energy to attack. He takes the virtual lead of the overall standing. He's one of the very best climbers, capable of accelerating on any summit climb. A teammate has just been dropped. You can't count on him any longer. He's attacking. Whatever you do, don't let him build a lead. Here's the positions over the last climb. You were first over the top of the climb. That's good. He is one of the best punchers, but he's also very comfortable in the mountains. He's attacking to catch up. Behind, the yellow jersey is moving onto the offensive. Labelled as puncher, he does very well in the mountains and has a good turn of speed. You still have 10 kilometers to make up some time. Not far off. Stay awake. It will soon start to move in the peloton. The breakaway riders will be fighting for victory on the last climb. The yellow jersey does not necessarily need to attack. Depending on his lead, can simply follow attacks and counter at the very end of a stage. The final ascent is six kilometers with an average gradient of 8.5%. But the summit is the most daunting. The last 300 meters are at more than 15%. He's an excellent climber who must be watched continuously and also one of the best descenders in the peloton. He's attacking. Whatever you do, don't let him build a lead. At 
Attack! We've got to react straight away. He's a threat to us. Only five kilometers left for the race leaders. Watch out! You're not going to be able to ride out of the saddle for much longer. As it's a summit finish, the points for the mountain jersey are doubled. Behind! The yellow jersey is moving onto the offensive. Another two kilometers. It's tight. Nobody's got a significant lead. right behind you, but it's worth a try. You're ahead of the group with the favorites by 30 seconds. To win today, Here's the winner of the Mulhouse La Planche des Belfi stage, Alberto Contador! Congratulations to him. He managed to maneuver perfectly to snatch this victory. He is in sparkling form and you can clap him loudly. Here's the polka dot jersey of this Tour de France, Alberto Contador! It is a moment that he soon won't forget and which marks his career. Come on, let's applaud him once more.